You see the thing about life The way it works is like this right Very few people Are gonna call you About something positive I mean For us that grew up in the hood The gutter, the slums Most phone calls is like negative Like yo what you doing son Come to the block I mean, really, you know, what you doing, though, son? Go to the block for what? If you going to the block to watch the next man get money, you's a bird. Facts. Because a real dude would tell you, yo, come to the block. Not so you could watch him get money, but so... He can show you how you can get some facts. It don't have to be negative in any way. But I know a lot of dudes that's on blocks just watching facts. What the fuck you watching for? You gonna go to jail and you ain't even get a dollar? Not even a slice of pizza, because some of these dudes you hang out with, and they'll let you starve the whole day, bro. Some of these dudes will eat in front of a nigga and not even offer you nothing. I don't hang out with dudes like that, man. That shit is weird. <laughs> On the lockout, biatch. Honestly, with no fronting, you know what I used to do to dudes like that? Chill for a few, figure out how Duke is. And then just rob him, boop. Let me get that. Shut the fuck up. Shh, shh. Don't blow it up. <laughs> Facts. <laughs> so we working on a lot of new things. I'm waiting for iHeartRadio to hit me back up. They take about 14 days. Thanks a lot to all the people that hit like the good luck shit. You feel me? Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, the comments. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Uh-uh, your award, you got this. They gonna approve you. Uh-uh, iHeart is one of the hardest ones to get approved from. Cause you already know it's iHeart, you feel me? Breakfast club, all that, you heard? <laughs> but anyway, yeah. You know, a lot, a lot of them been approving me already like these uh, podcast apps or, you know, online services thing, man. Whatever you want to call it, right? But, uh, yeah. We in there, man. We ain't playing with them because I switch a uh, podcast host. You know, and I mean like audio podcast, not YouTube where it's visual, just audio shit. That shit is important. That's where the bread is at. You better get up. They pay more than YouTube, fact. So here's the thing. You need a hosting service before you can get on a lot of these audio podcasts. Like the major ones too. Like you get this... You mean you can get on Cashbox? You know I like Cashbox because people could call in during the live and talk, and everybody hears them. You having a conversation, all that. That's that one is kind of cool, you know. But a lot of people started doing a lot of crazy shit on it. Like you know what I'm saying? It got kind of crazy. But uh, I still tune in from time to time. It's good, like to uh, how you say it, like. To go on there and it brings a different audience Whether it's to your YouTube Or whatever else you're doing in life, man It's different people You know what I'm saying? It's like a different world Facts And a lot of people get to know about you That didn't know about you Before you got on there And it's just like YouTube Some people are gonna love you Some are gonna hate you You worry about the ones that love you So in the beginning When you get with this hosting service And you pick one Whether it's Anchor FM whether it's Red Circle, whether it's Pop Bean, whether it's Buzzsprout, whatever one you pick, there's a lot of free ones out there that work just as good as the paid ones. Facts. It's always good to get with a company that's coming up because you're going to go up with them, right? And if they go down, what do you got to lose? <laughs> you're not up anyway right now, you feel me? So get with the program, man. Don't cry on why you ain't got a job and people lost their jobs with all this happening. They put the job in the palm of your hand. Get it. So-
So when you first find your hosting server, right? They're the ones that you just put your uh, RSS feed, right? Or RS or RSS feed. Either or I like that, right? You put that link, boom, in the other apps. And from there on, when you post a new episode, they send it directly to all them other podcasts. So you don't got to do it manually one by one, right? You find one of those. So in the beginning, you're doing a little work where you go into the other apps and you're trying to get approved by them and all that. Once you approve, you put that link into the hosting server and you lit. So it's not that easy like, yo, you just sign up, boom, and it sends it to all of them in the world. It doesn't work that way. Right now, I'm working, waiting for iHeart, uh, iTunes. I'm waiting for a few of them to answer me back. Because it's just like YouTube, not everybody gets approved to get to the bread or do your uh, content, put your content out there. That's just facts. Like, it doesn't matter if you have a thousand subscribers and four thousand hours of watch time. YouTube doesn't approve everybody. This is facts. Depends on your content. They'd be like, Bobby, <laughs> you need to come back and try later. Facts. You know what I'm saying? Or hit you with the thing. Error. Right now we're having technical difficulties. We'll get back to you. <laughs> you already know how that goes. So, yeah, that's one of the things that I was working like all night doing, connecting, you know, trying to connect them to the hosting service. Once all that is done, though, the rest is history. You feel me? So you can put for like 15 of them. There's a lot of them you can ask to be approved to be in. But before you do all this, you have to have one episode and on your hosting server. You get it? Because when you put that RSS feed, if I'm saying it right, RSS feed or RRS, no, it's RSS feed if I'm not. When you put that link in them other apps, they're going to tell you you need to have at least one episode. Facts. Now, I don't know what happened with me when I put this first episode I did yesterday, which is up now, now on, 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 uh, I posted the, the app name, I forget, somewhere here in the bottom, <laughs> you know what I mean, it's there, B, so there's a new episode there, I was just talking for like 21 minutes, a half an hour, or whatever, just to get back in the hang of things. Of uh, podcasting facts, yeah. So go check that motherfucker out. Download it, share it. Tell your friend to tell a friend. You heard? You listen to this crazy ass mother named Warpath. You heard facts. And if not, then it's all good. You know, I don't even get mad. You heard? If you want to listen to it, hey, be mad. You know what I'm saying? It is what it is. Ah, nah, I'm only fucking with you. No, I'm not. But anyway, I'm. <laughs> Do your thing, man. You heard? This shit is for everybody. Plus, that shit keeps me out of trouble, man. You know, I just recently started running the streets a little something again. Like, hard body. You know, like, I love the streets, but the streets don't show you no love back. Facts. But I'm good at catching myself. Like, ah! Hold up, pop. Because, you know, we never really stop until somebody stops us. You feel me? Or you up north on the island about to head up state to do a bid. And a new one right now? Nah, that's it, Pika. Facts. I'm not doing that, pa. Nah, nah, what? So you already know what it is, Pela Niema. <laughs> uh, that's it, bro. You know, trying to link up with at least 40 different podcasts and, and, and get my shit out there. You feel me? Again, this is the first episode that I put up there. I'm talking about Rikers Island, my first time on the island when I ran into Dominican Ralphie, you know, because people like them stories and what to do to stay off the island and what to do to stay out of jail, right? Or what to do when you get to jail, right? <laughs> Either or, bro, it's fucking easy as fuck to get in there and hard as a motherfucker to get out. Something to think about, little nigga. Facts. Go download Stitcher. Check it 
out on Stitcher. All you gotta look for is the same shit on the lockout. You gonna see me right there. Boop with the sunglasses, the mask on, the lock in the mouth. You feel me? Keep on. Gang shit. Lockout gang. We that familiar, you heard? Stop playing with me. Dudes is mad. We started our own thing. I've been like that though. I've been doing this with Golden Culture, Tech for Rec, all that. For years. You feel me? You just didn't know about it because you wasn't hip to this world. Now you here and you like, only shit, I know something from Sunset. Yo, Maria, look. It's Obi. No, my son. He does the podcast thing. You know those shows with the microphone? They look stupid with the big headphones like a news reporter. He does that. Taki Jow, the journalist. Mia, check him out. I mean, yeah, but he looks kind of young. Ay, tu viste la mamá. Chacho, no el matá, gorda con cojones. <laughs> you already know them people, they be gossiping and such. So stop playing, man. You already know everybody got that one lady who's always out the window. No matter what go down, she love them. Boop. Like, me, I chill, mama, you're <laughs> Gun We in the building, Brooklyn, what up, though? Yo, get to it, you heard? Don't play with them. You know why? Because they're not playing with you. And they're not going to tell you what's happening on this online world. Because they don't want you here, you heard? They think you're going to take up all the bread, all the fun and all that, man. It's for everybody, man. There's billions of people online. Trillions of dollars online streaming is making more money than all you motherfucker. You feel me? Donald Trump is regulating all the rules. They getting involved. The president's getting involved is a reason. So let me tell you what I've been doing for the last three days. Facts on gold. I've been locked in. Getting on my computer, getting on my phone, right? Because your phone, you don't need a computer, so stop making excuses. Your phone is your computer. Facts. So, when I started all this, I started with a phone. And when I lost that phone, I grabbed an Obama phone, a welfare phone. And when there was no Wi-Fi around me, the times I was fresh out, I went to the block in the corner. There's Wi-Fi everywhere. Facts. Oh, that they put that there so the feds can follow up on you, man. The, they gonna follow up on you with that or without that if they on you, bro. It's not playing and making excuses. You already ain't no feds or trying to find out. That Wi-Fi is there for everybody to use, my dude. You bugging. You doing too much periks. Ita panic out, my nigga. Facts. Relax. Record your shit, do you, and don't worry about nobody. If you ain't doing nothing wrong, you good. Plus, once you start getting online and you trying to generate something or start a business or a show, all that illegal shit, little by little, should be, be, be put to the side, facts. Because now, you got to be putting your legitimate name on a lot of things. If when they start paying you, you're trying to get to the bag, Cause then they're gonna be all this not you. I mean, you could change it later on, but a lot of times when we fill out shit with different aliases, we forget, bro. You want to make up a fake Gmail account and all that? Now that's that page is no longer yours because you can't get into it. Now you looking like you got the dumb face. <laughs> so fill this shit out properly, man. I made that mistake a few times, man. Facts. That all you got. Yeah, so that's how we moving today, yo. I feel like coming out and talking to the people on IG. You feel me? And giving y'all a little money, a little paper, a little knowledge, yo. Something to take back with you and think. Facts. If you're going through hard times right now, don't worry about it. Instagram is a d illusion. Like, it'll let you think that the world is rich. Oh, man, she's doing good. He's doing good. Nah, they not. Yo, when somebody's trying to shine so much... It's because they trying to hide the pain that's under all that. Facts. You heard? How the fuck you come on an app and everybody's a multimillionaire? Nobody's suffering. Everybody's bills are paid. Everybody's working. The fuck out of here. Not even in the movies, my nigga. So get to it, man.
So it don't have to be a fake post, you heard? So you just not doing it for the gram. Bueno, mi gente, no se pierdan el próximo capítulo de Vacilando con Guerra en el show esta tarde. Tuvimos un tiempo maravilloso, tú y yo. Mañana continuamos con el mismo vacilón. Cuídense y que tengan un día bien maravilloso. Que vayan en paz. Yo soy Walter Mercado. <laughs> What up? <laughs> Bugging. Warpath. Get it, man. Stay blessed, man. I hope I could make you laugh or smile or something, man. You feel me? And if I didn't, then there's something mentally wrong with you. And you need to check that out, man. Facts. Before you hurt yourself, little nigga. <laughs> you already know what that is. Commissary, nigga. <laughs> Facts. Can't forget about that. It all goes together, you heard? On the commissary. <laughs> Twelve upper. Commissary walking out. Grab your pillowcases. And there's no coffee. Hmm? You know what? I'm tight right now, so I'm going to take it out on this nice big egg sandwich. Get a huevo. Get a huevo, cabrón. Get a huevo. Get a huevo. Get a huevo. <laughs>